Hi, this is the Newsreel. Rick Perry's tangle with Travis County's prosecutors has taken another turn with revelations in the Texas Tribune that the governor's emissaries were trying to engineer the DA's ouster even after the governor vetoed funding for her office's public integrity unit. That DA, Rosemary Lemberg, was arrested and served jail time for drunk driving. Perry said during the last legislative session that he would veto funding for her office unless she resigned. Now a grand jury is looking into it, and that could put Perry on the hot seat he had reserved for Lindbergh. Ken Paxton is reviewing and researching himself. That's a quote. The state senator, a candidate for attorney general, apparently didn't disclose all of his sources of income and business relationships on the forms required of all state office holders, and that has heated up his current runoff race for AG against re state representative Dan Branch of Dallas. And the state attorney general's office is looking into a land dispute along the Red River up on the Texas-Oklahoma border. It is either federal land or private land. That's the dispute. The Bureau of Land Management's ongoing update of its resource management plans has apparently stirred the pot up there in North Texas. And that's the newsreel.